The Dark Magicians are finally going to get a buff that they deserve, and my god, this deck is going to be so much fun to play with all these cards coming out. Now, at the time of recording this, it's not confirmed which new cards are coming in the next update. We know we're going to get the casual mode, but the way the game is lining up, we should be getting the Battle of Chaos update, which is going to consist of the Dark Magician stuff. And the blue eyes stuff. I did a blue eyes video yesterday, and that video I mentioned I was gonna do this. Yeah, I know you're tired of Dark Magician at this point, but I'll be real with you, I don't care. This is my favorite deck in the game. Amongst the update, we got the Illusion of Chaos that's coming out, and then we got Timaeus the United Dragon. Now, Illusion of Chaos is interesting because you're not gonna be really using this card to play with. Essentially, what you do is you use this to search out Magician Souls. So, having three Magician Souls on top of everything else in the deck is cool. But sometimes you can open up without having Magician Soul in your hand. If you happen to have this, if you have three of these and three Magician Souls, you have a much better chance of getting Dark Magician out early. So essentially what they do is, is you can reveal this card, and then you fish out any Dark Magician card or Dark Magician card mention card from your deck, and add to your hand, and you place one card on top of your deck. Now Timaeus, I'm very excited about. What this card does is you send a Spellcaster or Spell Trap Dimensions Dark Magician into the graveyard, and they can special summon this. And then immediately you can fusion summon into a monster that uses this as material. So in other words, you can bring out the Dragon out really, really quick. On top of that, you can search for this. Like literally, Illusion of Chaos, We'll let you search for this. You summon this, the Dragon Knight comes out really easily. It's a free fusion. And then at that point, you have your almost unbreakable board. Unless, of course, you come across Kaijus or stuff that sends your entire field away, like Zeus. Then it's a problem. But in general, these two cards are going to make Dark Magician so much more fun. And if you're tired of me playing Dark Magician before, just wait for this update to come out in the near future. Unfortunately, though, we don't have that update today. We are just going to be running our my standard Phoenix Magician, as I like to call it, setup. A lot of people always ask me for my deck list for this, and here it is. I feel like... I, I could have sworn I'd go over this deck every single time before I start recording, but this is it right here. You can just screenshot it and grab it yourself. I always recommend that you make your own version of the deck. Don't just copy and paste it. But if you do that, I'm not going to stop you. But I like to do this as a, as a turn two deck. So instead of having like the spell book of knowledge and secrets in here, instead I got myself an extra Veiler and I got Imperm. So without further ado, let's see how this works out in gold. I mean, honestly, it shouldn't be that bad, but let's see what happens. If you don't run into flu or prank kids, you're fine. Do I want to go first? I'm going to go first. The reason why I hesitated there is because this deck is built for second. But if I open up without my my hand traps, I will just immediately lose. And I, obviously, that's not a good thing. So let's see how this works out. Give me something good. Yeah, no, this is ass. Yeah, oh, this is this is great. This, ooh, love to see that. <laughs> why? Harvey's Feather Duster and I end my turn. Or I, I, I leave. <laughs> All right, so best case scenario, they run some kind of dark monsters because then I can bring out Starving Dragon if they summon two. Oh no. And it's flu. All right, GG's, thank you for playing. This is comical. This is actually comical. Okay, now we can actually do something here. Well, depends, 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 depends. So what I need here is we have Fusion Destiny, which is gonna be great. But if this is this is a 45 card deck, why? Unfortunately, there's nothing I can do here. If I do this, check this out. If I do this, do you have Ash? Please Ash this if you have Ash. Thank you. <laughs> Woo! Okay, perfect. You know what? I'm gonna stop this. I'm gonna stop this. I'm gonna stop this. I'm gonna stop this. I want to know what my next three cards are, because if I can snag Soul Servant. Oh, they have Maxi as well, probably. Yep. If I can snag Soul Servant, but no, my luck, it's going to be just, I don't know, three normal monsters or effect monsters I can't add. Yep, I was right. Okay, cool. And then we just go into Fusion Destiny. We should reshuffle our deck, which is probably for the better. And then go into Defense Mode in case they hit me with craziness. So if they summon two Dark types, it will, they're going to do Light types. I guess I could do Mud Dragon. You always gotta have a second plan. The reason why I love running DP so much is number one, it's a great card. You should always run it. And two, it allows for more freedom with something like this. Because otherwise, there's nothing you can do here. Okay, so we have a light machine. Perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect. No, this is light machine. They're both light machine. Damn. Oh, they're just gonna take it back. Chimera Tech Dragon. Of course you are. Okay, Welp. Let's see what we can do here. The, the worst part is Dark Magician being in my hand, I can't even draw two from the Celestial here, so this sucks. <sighs> Upstart's great. 
Unless they, of course, happen to have an Ash Blossom and an Ash Blossom upstart. Never, ever Ash upstart. Ever. It's stupid. It's dumb! Why would you do that? Like, it's actually stupid. Like, luckily, me having this hand was not that great. But, like, you should never... It's, it's one card. I often want to upstart bait for an Ash, but it never happens in higher ranks. I'm just hoping that they have one more dark type. If they bring out one more dark type, it's a wrap. You're about to get hit with the meanest super poly of 2022. Oh, it's a dark type. Yes. Please, please normal summon that. What is that? That's a dark type, but they're probably just going to discard it. Oh, no. Well, wait, they can't special summon that because I have no monsters in my field, right? Yeah. Thank God. Okay, we can do it. 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 Let me do it. Let me do it. Nope. No, no, no. No, no, no. You're getting super polyed. Why is it not let me do it? Oh, that's even better. I can take I can take both of these. Why can't I do my thing? Oh, thank God. I was like, please let me activate my card, man. Let's get rid of you. <sighs> that's so annoying. Okay. Well, this is also annoying for them. Oh, and we can get you out too. We can get that annoying Predator plant out. Dragosapelia. Oh my god, I'm surprised I couldn't do it earlier. <laughs> They're going to defensive mode because they, they know. <laughs> they know. You know what? Here, hold, hold, a, hold a counter. Hold a counter real fast. There you go. There you go. <gasps> oh, this is fantastic. This is fantastic because now I can do this. So I'm going to go ahead and put... Actually... I didn't go leave! Come on, man! They had no chance. They had no chance. Oh my god, man. I got so lucky. I got lucky. Can I win a coin toss? We can. Yes. So, if you want to run the second turn variation, you can. I'm sure you can make a better version of it at, you know, than I did. I just don't like the fact that if you end up winning a coin toss and you want to go first, you might have a horrible hand. Alright. Oh, this is a great hand. This is a beautiful hand, even. So, what we do first is we summon... Yes. Oh, they got nothing. This is great. So I have options I can do here. I think what I probably will do is we'll grab Soul Servant. Let's grab Soul Servant. Because then what I can do is I can do this and put uh, Souls on top. And then you upstart. I can't believe the upstart is at 3 or at 1 in the TCG. It being at 3 in this game is crazy. And then we send Dark Magician. Yeah, Dark Magician away. Do I... Yeah, it's the plus one. Plus one over here. There you go. Give me something good. Magician Salvation would be great. I literally am a, I'm the Pharaoh sometimes. I'm going to set this right here. And then we immediately go into Secret Village. The thing about Secret Village is you might hate it because it is a floodgate. Yeah, they have to leave. You might hate it. It is a floodgate. But, like, it... This is the only... Re this is one of the main reasons... Why the deck can be strong going first. That's why I have three in it, you know? Because the problem with, with Dark Magician is if you don't have that protection from Dragonite, which Tamea should make more consistent, the second they, they drop Lightning Storm or they hit you with Harpy's Feather Duster, you just lose. And being able to stop them from doing that is just so key. It's not needed, but it helps us so much for, more in that first turn. Let's go first. So I'm not going to show it, but I did run into a deck early that had all normal monsters. It's weird. It's literally all they had. Oh, this hand is not that good. You know what? It, it can be good. It can be good. It can be good. Okay, so if we do this, if I grab Soul Servant, and if I do Soul Servant into, yeah, you, and then Upstart, my, what I'm hoping here happens is when I summon a Dark Magician, I just get it out of my deck number one, so I don't draw it later. I'm hoping that I either draw into Secret Village here, or I go into Secrets of Dark Magic, which are really, really low chance. Come on. Be on my side. Luck. Draw. Cool. Awesome. Great. Love to see it. I guess we'll just go into this and call it a day. And this is all I can do. Cool. All right. 
I guess I technically could have gone into Artemis here, but I don't really want to. Forbidden Droplet. Fusion Destiny. Interesting. That means they have two in their hand. I'm going to pop myself just for, just in case. I don't think Forbidden Droplet will, will stop me from coming back next turn. But let's see what happens. So again, Forbidden Droplet, you want to send the same card away. Oh, they're mutants. It's Arsenal. And... Oh, no. It's going to stop spells. And Nemesis Corridor. All right. 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 That's going to be awful. Well, this is fantastic. What I could do is... I have an idea. I have an idea. I know how to play. I know how to play around this. I know how to play around this. Unless they have call by the grave right now, in which case I lose completely. I just get my back blown out. Of course, now I get called by. Actually, no, this is great. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's bring you out first. We do this. We send uh, this away. Oh, but they can negate it. They can negate it. Okay, okay, okay. That's fine. Good bait. Good bait. Good bait. Because now I can really thin my deck out here in a second. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to attack, and then I'm going to pop myself on onto Colossus. I don't think they have anything else to stop me from getting from destroying this. This could be a this could be a good setup. So what we do now is we attack. Oh god, what does that do? What do you bring out? Oh. But what's coming out though? Oh, uh, how much was that? Was that level nine to bring it out? Okay. That's gonna be a problem. All right, now we can actually still play. So I summon you. Let's get secrets out. Let me pop secrets. To get knowledge out. Imagine you can do spellbook of knowledge for spell casters in your hand that aren't prophecy. That'd be insane. Do this. Oh, this is great. Water and earth, though, so that's not really that useful. Oh, soul servant, though. That's great. This. I can grab salvation there we go <gasps> little okay this is fantastic i think i think i think i think i don't know what else, what else can you do here wait oh i forgot that's very very bad the correct answer here surprisingly is dark magic circle yep 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 all right salvation i guess i'll just pop myself to kill this and then I am a turn okay damn let's bring you back here in defense mode because I'm not trying to get hit here so dealing with Kenyan it's gonna be really really annoying <laughs> oh my god they're two water types they're two water types they're gonna leave here they're gonna leave here they're gonna leave here they're gonna leave here they absolutely leave here they absolutely leave here they absolutely leave here. <laughs> Me. This is going to be annoying to deal with. This is why you always have a mud dragon of the swamp in your deck. They absolutely... There's no way to take a plane. No, I'm not done yet. I ain't done yet. I'm bringing out my, my spellcasters. All of them. All of them. Oh, wait. I didn't activate it. God damn it. It's fine. That's a very awful draw here. Why did I... Why, wait, why can't I activate this? Oh, he did get rid of my Dark Magician. That's why. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to attack mode. That's really, really bad. I guess I'll just uh, go back into main two and set this. So they're very, very smart. They're very... I forgot they can also do that. I forgot to draw two. Why am I doing this? Rhyme, you idiot. I guess in my mind, I was expecting them to, to ban Dasher. Because, that's again, that's a smarter option. Is get rid of Dasher. Let's get rid of... I think I get rid of you. There you go. Yeah, no, they're stupid for that. Dasher should, should have absolutely been the option there. Mutant Fusion, that's going to be annoying. But they can't play that, right? No, they can't play it. They can't play it. Ooh. You know what? That's okay. That's okay. I just realized when they summon their mutant fusion, they can pop this and it'll, it'll clear my field. 
Damn. If my next card, if one of my next two cards happens to be um, Secret Village, I definitely hella misplayed here. What are you doing? Why did you not? Okay. Unfortunately, I got to a real slow way here. Real slow way. So I have to basically bring DPE back. At a t I have to. I have to. Yes. I Unfortunately, I have to do this. 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 Because I misplayed earlier. Okay. So this means they're unaffected by basically effects of those cards. We'll just do this. We'll just do this. So what I need, perfect world, will be just to draw into Magician's Souls and Circle right now. What are the chances? Close. This works out. This works out. Because what I'm going to do is, I'm going to do this. And I'm going to activate this to bring out Dark Magician and Dark Magician Girl. And then Salvation is going to activate. So he's unaffected by monster effects. Then I'll activate this to draw two more. And that's in the graveyard. Draw twice. Upstart, please let me get my uh, Secret Village. Please, man. All right, no Secret Village, apparently. So Nightmare Unicorn will work. If I do this. That's not going to work, so there's no point in activating the effect, right? You know what? Let's just do it anyways. I just want to make sure. Correct. Okay, just thought, thought so, thought so, thought so. And then I can go into access code. I think spider over here. Is this game mathematically speaking? I think it is. Let me do this. I gotta make sure I click on unicorn. Yes! And it doesn't matter, so I'm just gonna attack here. Attack! And mathematically, it does not check out yet, but they have... Oh, yeah, they have this effect as well. That's fine. And then, can I not attack with... Oh, I can still attack with him. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We have game here. To the people who didn't think I know that this... <laughs> I can't do this. I, I can absolutely do this. Let's go do Dracostopalia. And then we attack for game. And that is how you outplay somebody. Even though their deck isn't that great, but whatever. Attack! Woo! That was a very satisfying play. Very satisfying play. All right, I'm gonna end the video right here. This is my 10,000 Dark Magician deck video. When this update comes out in the near future, expect many, many more. I'm gonna just keep it real with you. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.